Okay. Hi, this is John from Chicago. Welcome to my channel. As you can see, I finally got this quad flying. Um, it's about four weeks behind schedule, but um, um, you often get delays on uh, various builds. Um, I had a, I used a few parts from this one on another build that I'm doing. I'm doing a, a Mode 2 Ghost uh, that'll be super lightweight. It should be about 30, 40 grams lighter than this one. I'm using uh, the uh, 11 or 2204 motors uh, instead of the 2205s and um, and uh, it should be uh, a really nice build also but I got this one running uh, a couple of delays as I switched out the um, flight control ESC all in one board I'll list it down in the description below but it's called a uh, I got it from ready to sky it's a flip 32 F4 all-in-one uh, Midgard um, board. Uh, it was uh, fairly inexpensive. It was $43, but I picked the wrong board. I should have picked one with the OSD built in. This one, you could add an OSD by adding a chip. Um, so instead of putting an OSD on this, I just switched out the camera to a micro swift with OSD on it. So at least I got the voltage and the runtime and the name of the model on there. Uh, so this is the um, my new build. It uh, weighs um, 258 grams dry weight, and uh, it seems to fly quite good. I got a break in the weather yesterday, so I was able to get out and do a couple runs on it. Uh, I will probably do a part three. I wanted to look at these props. These are the uh, Wind Dancer um, Gem Fan. Um, 50, 42 props. I figured I didn't want a real strong pitch with these 2600 uh, kV motors. Uh, so they seem to be pretty good, but what I really need to do is time some runs uh, with this one versus some other props to uh, optimize that. I also have a GPS I could put on this um, to see how fast it's going. I had a day between snowstorms here in Chicago, so I got out to fly. I was going to take it easy. Taking it easy, I still managed to hit the tree twice. But anyways, I got the idea to build two ultralight 5-inch uh, racing uh, quads uh, from watching uh, Stu's video, his uh, November 2nd video on the Avent Devil. Uh, which he had a speed of, uh, on a speed gun, I think it was 200 or 111 miles an hour. And uh, the quad only weighed 234 grams dry weight at a cost of $367. Well, I thought, uh, hey, I could build something quite similar for about half the price. And that's where I got the idea to build this quad and a, another one um, uh, with the uh, Mode 2 Ghost frame and uh, 2204 motors. So I'm working on these two. And then after I started it, uh, Stu decided to build two of them also for $170. So this is an option to what he's uh, building, another way of doing it. Uh, I think people had made the uh, decision to go uh, to larger and faster motors uh, above the 2205 motors way too fast. Uh, I think the 2205 motors uh, gives plenty of speed at a high efficiency um, with lots of acceleration as long as you keep the model light. This model is fast, but I'll, I don't know how fast, but I'll find out once the racing season starts and how durable it is, and I'll come back with a part three. I have list, listed the components in the description below. If you have any questions, uh, please, answer, please ask those in the comments below also. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next build.